In this video, I'll offer clarity on Alert Service Bulletin ASB912I007. You'll see how to determine whether an engine is affected, and if it is, exactly what you'll be looking for. I'll also give a demonstration of how to seat a ceiling plug using the Rotax insertion tool. This video is for demonstration purposes only. Refer to the Service Bulletin for official details. You can download a copy of this Service Bulletin by clicking on Technical Documentation at flyrotax.com. This is a mandatory alert service bulletin which affects Rotax aircraft engines both certified 912 ISC Sport and non-certified 912 IS and 912 IS Sport. Refer to Section 1.1 of the Alert Service Bulletin for specific engine and ignition housing serial numbers affected. Field observation has shown that there is a possibility of oil leakage in the area of the ignition housing within a limited number of production engines. This Alert Service Bulletin describes how to check and, if necessary, how to reset the ceiling plug position. During the manufacturing of 912IS ignition housings, oil galleries are drilled to provide pressurized oil to the rear crankshaft bushing, as well as an oil cooling jet for the stator assembly. Where these machined oil galleries meet, a purpose-designed ceiling plug is inserted. The ball of the ceiling plug is then pressed into place, which expands the plug for a permanent seal against the ignition housing. In isolated cases, the ceiling plug was not fully pressed to its correct seating position. This may lead to an oil leakage and in rare cases may lead to loss of oil and subsequently loss of lubrication, which can lead to engine stoppage. A simple visual inspection is required to verify the correct seating position of the ceiling plug. On a correctly positioned ceiling plug, the top of the ball is below the edge of the sleeve. On this particular ignition housing, the ball of the ceiling plug is well below the edge of the sleeve. If the visual inspection shows good ceiling plug position, then no further action is required. On an incorrectly positioned ceiling plug, the top of the ball is level with or above the edge of the sleeve. Fortunately, a ceiling plug can have its ceiling position corrected. You'll need a Rotax insertion tool or equivalent, part number 676255, and a hammer. A firm hammer with a maximum weight of approximately 330 grams or half a pound is required. A rubber mallet or dead blow hammer will absorb some of this impact and it's not recommended for this procedure. The Rotex insertion tool is precision machined to seat centrally on the ball of the ceiling plug. If there's any oil or coolant deposits, corrosion or debris around the ceiling plug, spray the area with solvent or cleaner and blow dry with compressed air. Try a test blow with a hammer using only enough force to press the ball below the height of the sleeve. Don't use excessive force and ensure that the insertion tool remains centered on the ceiling plug. Continue to gently tap the insertion tool until the top of the ball is below the height of the sleeve. This setting process expands the ceiling plug as designed and creates a permanent seal. Conduct an engine test run and check for oil leakage at the ceiling plug. Now a log entry can be made in the engine's logbook stating compliance with ASB 912I007. Local aviation authorities may also require compliance with possible airworthiness directives. The checking 
and if necessary the resetting of the sealing plug, must be conducted before the next flight on affected engines. Undelivered engines must be checked before delivery, and engines or ignition housing spare parts must be checked before installation. For price and availability of the Rotax insertion tool, contact your local Rotax authorized distributor or their independent service centers. A list of all Rotax authorized distributors and their independent service centers is provided on flyrotax.com. You can find other videos on the official Rotax Aircraft Engines YouTube channel, Fly Rotax.